who's power hungry. Oh, hi. So, how are you holding up? Because I'm a potato. Yeah. Oh, good. My slow clap processor made it into this thing. So we have that. <laughs> Since it doesn't look like we're going anywhere, well, we are going somewhere, alarmingly fast, actually. But since we're not busy other than that, here's a couple of facts. He's not just a regular moron. He's the product of the greatest minds of a generation, working together with the express purpose of building the dumbest moron who ever lived. Mm. And you just put him in charge of the entire facility. Good, that's still working. Okay. okay. Just in case this pit isn't actually bottomless, do you think maybe you could unstrap one of those long fall boots of yours and shove me into it? Just remember to land on one foot. Let's see how this goes. The bird is still Gladys. Okay. It's basically a hallway. Mm-hmm. 
Okay. So that's on a timer where I need to hit both. that I would not expect to be voicing. They definitely got a lot of funding for this game. And, and, uh, at least by comparison to the fur. Because I definitely wouldn't expect it for the first one. That was, it struck me as being more of an indie team, so.
kind of. on this yet. I might be wasting time. Definitely wasting time doing that. The other option is that flings me there. That says enter. Once I get up there, I can switch the portal to be there and see what's there, maybe. Those of you who volunteered to be injected with praying mantis DNA, I've got some good news and some bad news. Bad news is we're postponing those tests indefinitely. Good news is we've got a much better test for you, fighting an army of mantis men. 
Pick up a rifle and follow the yellow line. You'll know when the test starts. series of tests, please let a test associate know, because in all likelihood, whatever comes out of you is going to be cold. Only temporary, so do not worry. If it persists for a week, though, start worrying and come see us, because that's not supposed to happen. What's that I'm supposed to be going there? Drop me. Okay, at the top of the elevator. Okay. What about? Eh, that's not what I wanted. At least not exactly.
say great science is built on the shoulders of giants. Not here. At Aperture, we do all our science from scratch. No hand-holding. Started. This first test involves something the lab boys call repulsion gel. You're not part of the control group, by the way. You get the gel. Last poor son of a gun got blue paint. <laughs> All joking aside, that did happen. Broke every bone in his legs. Tragic, mm -hmm. but informative. Or so I'm told. So. Spouse. informed me that I should not have mentioned the control group. They're telling me I ought to stop making these pre-recorded messages. That gave me an idea. Make more pre-recorded messages. Mm. I pay the bills here, I can talk about the control group all damn day. mini office over here for this next test we put nanoparticles in the gel in layman's terms that's a billion little gizmos that are going to travel into your bloodstream and pump experimental genes and RNA molecules and so forth into your tumors oh. now maybe you don't have any tumors well don't worry if you sat on a folding chair in the lobby and weren't wearing lead underpants we took care of that too So near the end, so I don't want to stop. Um, aha. Thank you. 
Covered in that repulsion gel. Here's some advice the lab boy gave me. Do not get covered in the repulsion gel. Uh, we haven't entirely nailed down what element it is yet, but I'll tell you this: it's a lively one, and it does not like the human skeleton. Ooh. 